create a YouTube API key. Before you start, you need a Google account to access your Google API console. Request an API key and register your application. Second thing we need to do is to create a project in the Google Developers Console and obtain authorization credentials so your application can submit API requests. And after creating your project, make sure the YouTube Meta API is one of the services that your application is registered to use. So now let's create. I'll leave this link in the description below. Please click this link. It takes you straight to the Google API. So I'm going to click this link now. Okay, this is it. Welcome to the API library. API library has documentation links, smart search experience. So what you need to do is, you can see, if you want to create API for Map, JavaScript, it's all here also, your Google Drive and stuff. So, but this is what we're doing. We're creating a YouTube API for embedded videos for the WordPress or your website. The WordPress website, depending, depending on the CMS you're using. Click this. Okay, this is what you need to do. You see? You need to manage. Yes, manage. Notes. So I've clicked manage, and this is what it's showing me. The reason why it's showing me this is because I've created my own API before. So if you're only showing this, don't worry. We'll create a new project, a new API. But if yours is not showing this, just wait. So just wait. So now, for those of you that are showing this, what we need to do is to create a new API. I'm going to click Projects. New Projects. So you can see so others others when you click this YouTube API on the next page we assume that you don't already have the Google Cloud project associated with the API key wait so you scroll down you enable this which we did in the previous video now it should just show you this create projects just show you this as if you click this enable if you've not created your API before it comes straight to this side this section then you click create well if not if not you go to you right click as like I said you go to manage your project then you click you type create project so my project name like I said earlier I'm working on an embedded plus youtube plugin for your wordpress website so that's why i'm creating this youtube api key you can use any project name you want depending on what you're using it for that's it when you click create click create immediately so when you click create it shows you this remember this section in the previous scene so the next thing we do now go to create credentials credentials when you click create credentials you know add, add credentials to your project click this Select what you want to use it for. You to get that API key. Where will you be calling the API from? So we're going to use this web server. Make sure you use web server. So what data will you be accessing? Public data. Public data. I think that's all. Yes, that's all. What credentials do I need? Okay, public data. What credentials do I need? Okay, what, what credentials do I need? So, tada, this is it API key.
then you copy so that's it so that's all and you're done that's it you're done creating the api key but note before you use this api key you need to add some restriction because we recommend restricting this key before using it in the production restrictions limits which websites ip address or apps can install apis with this key so you click on restrict key here okay this is it yes Yes, and you need to add this. Yes, Google API dot com. This you need to add this. Yes, this is what you need, you need to add this if you are going to use HTTP. If you are going to use IP, your IP, you know, you just add your IP address. If you are using this, you use this. Anyone it works, it will work. So anyway, it will work. Next one, click done. Yes. Okay. Yes, restrict key. Select API YouTube. Make sure you're using it for YouTube data. So we wait. We take five minutes for this this for the settings to take effect. And we save. Seven. Okay, after seven, click cancel. Click cancel. Okay, that's good. Cancel now. You can see it's created. You can copy your key now. This is my key. I'm just going to copy it and I'm going to use it. That's all. Thank you so much. Please don't forget to subscribe. Hit the notification button if you have any suggestion and question kindly let me know in comment section below